Hey, what's going on, Chikorita fans? It's me, Jake the Happy Snake here, and welcome back to my Pokemon Gold walkthrough. In the last part, I went inside the Bell Sprout Tower and I did all the crap in there. And in this part, I am going to take on the first gym of the game. Um, so yeah. Also, in um, in Kanto, Hoenn, and Sinnoh, the first gym um, are, is actually a rock type gym, but in this game, um, it's not a rock type gym, it's actually a flying type gym. The reason why that is, because there is a rock type gym later on in the game, like way later on in the game. But anyways, let's go inside. So yeah, very easy puzzle, but it's pretty hard, it's pretty much impossible to um, avoid all the trainers and stuff. Um, now actually what I'm going to do, is I'm going to actually put Murkrow on the front of my party. And the reason why that is, is I, I don't like, you know, I don't like having, um, my, like, a Pokemon that I caught equal with my starter Pokemon, but, like, like, equal in l level, you know. But, um, then this guy has a Pokemon that knows Peck, which will prop, which, which will pretty much murder my Chikorita. Um, so, I don't really want to go, I, I don't really want to, I don't really want to deal with that crap. And this guy right here actually has a Pokemon that doesn't have a move that's super effective against Chikorita, I don't think. So, yeah, that's my strategy. Anyways. Yeah. Battle this guy and beat him. Yeah, he has a Pidgey, which doesn't really know any flying type moves, I don't think. Maybe it does. Um, yeah, it just was Tackle, which is not threatening at all. Level 13, cool. Alright. Now, I'm going to actually go heal, and I'm actually going to use Chikorita first in the battle, because... I think I'd rather have my Murkrow go up against the gym leader's strongest Pokemon than my Chikorita. Because I've, I've done that before, and I just screwed up completely. Anyways. Wait, no, no, I only want to talk to you once. Thank you. Okay. Cool. Alright. Now, I can't believe this part's almost done. <laughs> wow, that was actually... Um, I, guess I, I guess I shouldn't speed through the battles, but... I'm not going to speed through this battle, because this is the first gym battle. I'll be getting my first gym badge. And once I have th um, this gym badge, I'll have 15 more gym badges to go. Here we go. I'm Faulkner. I used to think his name was Flanker, but then I found... That's when I got, first got into Pokemon. Then I found out that it's not spelled F-L-A-K-N-E-R. It's actually Faulkner, but anyways. I'm Faulkner. I'm Faulkner. The Violet Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. I wouldn't allow such insult to bird Pokemon. You're an idiot, seriously. Bird Pokemon? Like, seriously? Blind types? What the heck? I'll show you the real power of the magnific magnificent bird Pokemon. Here we go. I love this music. This is actually the same music as I had as I have for my intro music. Um, for my, you know, for every part of the, of this walkthrough, but... Alright, need a Faulkner like to battle. Pidgey! Alright, now seriously, this guy should have a Hoot Hoot. Like, he had, he had one in the anime. Did he, did he not? And Hoot Hoot's a Jodo Pokemon. Like, seriously, a Pidgey? Like, man, and, and look at this level! Like, Gym Leader, um, Rourke and Roxanne have Pokemon that are, like, level 15. Rourke's got a Cranny Dose level 15. Roxanne's got a, um, Dose Pass level 15. This guy's got level se level freaking 7, uh, Pidgey. Like, that is ridiculous. It's half the level of, of, uh, <laughs> level 15, but, okay. Uh, Tackle. Now, if I'm correct, eventually this Tackle will put him down in the very low red. But, this guy, the gym leaders don't heal, well, at least the first few, uh, at least the first couple don't heal. Um, and, well, I know this guy doesn't heal. Oh, okay. I, I actually didn't think, think that that would knock him out, but it did. So that's cool. Now, next up is his Pidgeotto. Now, this thing is a pain in the butt, okay? This thing is annoying as crap. Um, I'm going to go to Murkrow, because I don't think Chikorita is going to last at all. Like, at all. Like, it's level 9. Like, doesn't Pidgey... Pidgey doesn't evolve until level 18, so... How in the heck did you get a level 9 Pidgeotto? I, I could get a level 3 Pidgeot, but... Seriously. I, that's with cheats. You didn't cheat. At least, I, at least I don't think you did. But... Anyways, Peck! Actually, I think Pursuit is more powerful, so I'm not exactly sure why I did that, but... Alright. Pursuit... And, yeah, I think it's more powerful. But it doesn't matter. He won't heal, so I think I got this guy down, which is awesome. And his Gus is doing nothing. So, boom! See, he doesn't use potions. I don't know why. Like, it actually makes it a lot easier for me. But, man, gosh, this music is awesome. 
Alright, and gosh, I almost got to level 13, that was close. Alright, so we defeated him. There are my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. What? The, the, that, those were your dad's birds? Um, okay, that really didn't sound right. Alright, that really didn't sound right. Alright, the, Ze the Zephyr, I, the Zep, the Zephyr badge, I think. The Zep I don't know what it is, okay, I forget. Anyways, TM31, this is the worst TM ever. Mudslap. Like, it's Mudslap. Um, yeah, you're a flying type Pokemon person, you're not a, you're a flying type gym leader, not a ground type, why did you give me Mudslap, like, that is a complete waste, but, anyways, um, wait, actually, I would end off right here, but, somebody calls you, and yeah, that somebody is Professor Elm, the most, um, underrated professor of all time. But he's gonna tell you that, that there's somebody in the in the Pokemon Center uh, in Violet City that, that has an egg. So we're gonna actually do this right now, and then and then I'm gonna end off the part. But in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, actually, the guy gives you the egg in the Pokemon. So I'm not sure why they switched it, but they did. And I'm actually gonna heal. Uh, boom, boom, bow, baby, boom. Okay, cool. And cool. All right, and then. Talk to this dude. JDHS! Long time no see. Long time. Well, I. What do you mean long? It hasn't been that long. Seriously. Yes, sure. I'll take the egg. Yeah, the, uh, you know the egg that it has that like the Pokemon that hatches from the egg is kind of a piece of garbage. But if you hatch the egg and you go back to Professor Elm, like I said a, a couple parts ago, like I said a few parts ago, Professor Elm is obsessed with the Pokemon egg. What I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to. Uh, I, I'm actually gonna hatch the egg, and then go back to Professor Elm, and get a, and get an item that I'm gonna real, that I'm really gonna need later on. It's not required, but I'm gonna want it, so. Yeah, you'll find out what item that is in the next part. So thanks guys for watching, in the next video, I will be making my way to, um, what's that tunnel? Um, Unique Tunnel? No. No, what is it? No, not Unique Tunnel, what the heck? Ah. Uh. Man, my brain is rusty. Okay, I can't remember the name of it, but it's, um, what is it? 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 The, uh, ah, oh, I can't remember. All right, I'll just, I don't know. All right, thanks guys for watching, and um, please write, comment, subscribe. God bless you all, and I'll see you all in the next video. Adios.